My name is Paul Landry Aronson. I'm an MD at the Yale School of Medicine in the Departments of Pediatrics and Emergency Medicine. This topic is Acute Respiratory Distress Syndrome, otherwise known as ARDS. ARDS is an acute, diffuse, inflammatory injury of the lungs that results in widespread, increased pulmonary vascular permeability and leakage of fluid. This results in non-cardiogenic pulmonary edema with decreased lung compliance, loss of aerated lung tissue, hypoxemia, and the classic chest x-ray findings of bilateral coalescent opacities as seen here in this chest x-ray. Histiologic findings include diffuse alveolar damage and hyaline membrane formation. Causes of ARDS include sepsis, pneumonia, aspiration such as from drowning, smoke, or vomitus, or trauma, the sepsis being the number one cause. Symptoms and signs of ARDS include shortness of breath, tachypnea, retractions, respiratory distress, and on exam, bilateral crackles, often with decreased breath sounds. In addition, the patient may have hypoxemia that may not respond to O2 or administered oxygen. In addition, the patient may exhibit symptoms or signs of the underlying cause, for example, sepsis. Now, the evaluation of ARDS involves the following. An arterial blood gas should be obtained to be able to calculate the PaO2 to FiO2 ratio, which is the ratio of the partial pressure of oxygen in the arterial blood relative to the fraction of inspired oxygen being delivered to the patient. As the PaO2 decreases relative to the FiO2, the PaO2 to FiO2 ratio will decrease, and a ratio of less than 300 indicates ARDS, with less than 100 meaning severe ARDS. A chest x-ray is obtained and will demonstrate the bilateral coalescent opacities as described previously. Additionally, any evaluation for an underlying cause should be undertaken. The mainstay of therapy for ARDS is mechanical ventilation, with a goal tidal volume of 6 mLs per kilogram, which is required to adequately ventilate the lungs while minimizing ventilator-induced lung injury. A high positive end expiratory pressure, or PEEP, is often required to achieve adequate oxygenation during mechanical ventilation. It is really important to also treat the underlying cause. However, despite these maneuvers, ARDS is associated with a high mortality rate.